What are the most powerful warships in the Italian Navy? Which formidable machines make up their fleet? And can these vessels hold their own against some of the world's most advanced militaries? Well, today we'll answer all these questions as we explore the top 10 most powerful warships in the Italian Navy. In this list, we'll include only the best destroyers, aircraft carriers, and submarines currently in service in Italy. But before we dive into this thrilling ranking, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more military insights. And now let's jump straight into the world of Italian naval power, starting with the 10th ship on our list. Number 10, Larishi Class. The Larishi Class mine hunters are a key component of the Italian Navy's mine countermeasure fleet. Designed and built by the Italian shipyard Intermarine, these vessels specialize in detecting and neutralizing naval mines to ensure safe maritime operations. Introduced in the 1980s, only two units remain in active service, the Milasso and the Vieste. With a length of approximately 52 meters and a displacement of 503 tons, these ships are constructed using a fiberglass reinforced composite material. This design reduces their magnetic signature making them less susceptible to triggering mines. Each vessel is powered by a diesel engine providing 1,000 horsepower, allowing for a top speed of 15 knots. Their primary operational tool is a sophisticated sonar system, coupled with remotely operated underwater vehicles for mine detection and disposal. Number 9. Thaon de Revel Class The Thaon de Revel Class officially known as Patuliatori Polivalenti d'Altura, or PPA, represents a new generation of versatile warships developed for the Italian Navy by Fincantieri. These vessels, designed for multi-role operations, replace aging Soldati-class frigates and Minerva-class corvettes. With a modular design, the ships come in three configurations, light, light plus, and full, each offering increasing levels of combat capability. Powered by four diesel generators and two electric motors, the PPAs reach speeds over 57 km per hour. Their armament is impressive, featuring a 127mm gun, a 76mm rapid-fire cannon, and advanced missile systems like the Aster 30 for air defense and Teseo Mark II for anti-ship missions. The full configuration also includes torpedo launchers for anti-submarine warfare and a sophisticated radar suite enhancing their role in both surface and undersea combat. Number 8. Bergamini Class The Bergamini Class frigates, part of the Franco-Italian FREMM program, serve as versatile surface combatants within the Italian Navy. Built by Fincantieri, these frigates are designed for a range of operations, including anti-submarine warfare, anti-aircraft defense, and surface strike capabilities. Italy operates a total of 10 units, divided into two variants, six general-purpose frigates and four specialized in anti-submarine warfare. These vessels measure approximately 144 meters in length and have a full load displacement of around 6,700 metric tons. Powered by a Codlag propulsion system, they can reach speeds of up to 27 knots, offering a balance between speed and efficiency. Armament includes a 127mm OTO Malera main gun, capable of firing volcano precision-guided munitions, along with two 25mm remote weapon stations. For air defense, they are equipped with 16 vertical launch cells for Aster-15 and Aster-30 surface-to-air missiles. Number 7. Maestrale Class The Maestrale Class frigates, built by Fincantieri, have served as versatile anti-submarine warfare vessels in the Italian Navy since the 1980s. With a displacement of approximately 3,200 tons and a length of 122.7 meters, these ships are designed to operate effectively across various maritime roles, including anti-aircraft and anti-surface warfare. Powered by a combined diesel or gas propulsion system, they feature two Fiat General Electric LM two 500 gas turbines and two diesel engines, enabling a maximum speed of 59 km per hour and a range of 11,100 km at 28 km per hour. The frigates are armed with a range of weaponry, including a 127mm OTO Malera naval gun, 
ASPIED surface-to-air missiles, automat to co anti ship missiles, and a close-in weapon system for defense against aerial threats. Number 6. Durand de la Pen Class The Durand de la Pen Class destroyers are a pair of multi-role warships built by the Italian company Fincantieri for the Italian Navy. These vessels, named after Admiral Luigi Durand de la Pen, were commissioned in the early 1990s and are primarily designed for anti-air, anti-surface, and anti-submarine warfare, as well as coastal bombardment and convoy protection. With a displacement of 5,000 tons, they are powered by a combined diesel or gas propulsion system featuring two Fiat General Electric LM, two 500 gas turbines, and two diesel engines, allowing them to reach speeds exceeding 57 kilometers per hour. Their operational range at economical speeds of around 33 kilometers per hour exceeds 13,000 kilometers, making them suitable for long-range missions. The main armament includes a 127 mm OTO Malera gun, 376 mm Super Rapid guns, and two triple tube torpedo launchers. Number 5. Horizonte Class The Horizonte Class, also known as the Horizon Class, is a highly capable air defense destroyer currently in service with the Italian Navy. Developed through a collaboration between Italy and France, these vessels are designed to protect naval groups from airborne threats and are a key asset in NATO operations. Built by Fincantieri and Naval Group under the joint venture Naviris, the class includes two ships in Italian service, Andrea Doria and Caio Duilio. Each ship displaces around 7,000 metric tons and measures 153 meters in length. They are powered by a combined diesel and gas propulsion system, enabling a top speed of over 29 kilometers per hour. The primary armament includes the PAM's air defense system, featuring Aster-15 and Aster-30 surface-to-air missiles. Secondary weapons include a 127mm naval gun and multiple 76mm cannons for close-range defense. Number 4. San Giorgio Class the San Giorgio-class amphibious transport docks serve as a key component of the Italian Navy's amphibious warfare capabilities. Built by Fincantieri, the three ships in this class, San Giorgio, San Marco, and San Giusto, are designed to transport troops, armored vehicles, and landing craft, making them ideal for expeditionary missions and humanitarian operations. These vessels displace between 7,950 and 8,300 tons and measure 133 meters in length with a beam of 20.5 meters. Powered by two Grandi Motori Trieste diesel engines, each generating 8,400 horsepower, they can reach speeds of up to 39 kilometers per hour and have an operational range of 13,900 kilometers at cruising speed. The ships can carry a battalion of 350 troops along with 36 armored vehicles or 30 medium tanks, which can be deployed via a floodable well deck accommodating landing craft. Number 3. Cavour Class The Cavour Class aircraft carrier, the flagship of the Italian Navy, plays a critical role in Italy's maritime power projection and international military cooperation. Officially commissioned in 2008, the carrier is designed for multiple roles from air operations to humanitarian assistance. Measuring 244 meters in length and displacing around 27,100 tons, it can reach speeds of 30 kilometers per hour. Cavour is equipped with cutting-edge aviation technology, primarily operating the F-35B Lightning II stealth fighters alongside the AV-8B Harrier II+, Plus, although the latter is being phased out. The ship also carries up to two NH-90 helicopters for multi-purpose missions. Its flight deck and ski jump configuration enable short takeoff and vertical landing operations, optimizing air combat capabilities. Beyond its air wing, the carrier features a CODAG propulsion system, offering efficiency and flexibility in various operational conditions. Number 2. Sorrow Class the Sorrow-class submarines have been a cornerstone of the Italian Navy's underwater fleet since the late 1970s. Built by Fincantieri, these diesel-electric attack submarines were developed to enhance Italy's maritime defense capabilities. 
The class consists of four batches, with the final two being significantly modernized in terms of stealth, sonar, and combat systems. These submarines have an overall length of around 63 meters and a displacement of approximately 1,600 tons when submerged. The Soro class is equipped with advanced sonar and can operate at depths of over 300 meters. It features six torpedo tubes capable of launching heavyweight torpedoes or anti-ship missiles, making it a versatile platform for both offensive and defensive operations. Number 1 Todaro Class The Todaro Class submarines, also known as the Type U-212A, represent a crucial component of the Italian Navy's underwater fleet. Developed in collaboration with Germany, these submarines are produced by the Italian shipbuilder Fincantieri. Their design prioritizes stealth, endurance, and advanced technology, making them a formidable presence in maritime defense. Each Totoro class submarine is approximately 56 meters long and has a displacement of around 1,500 tons when surfaced. These vessels can operate at depths greater than 300 meters and maintain submerged speeds exceeding 16 kilometers per hour. A distinguishing feature is their air-independent propulsion system, which uses hydrogen fuel cells to generate power, allowing the submarine to remain submerged for extended periods without surfacing. As we conclude our exploration of the top 10 most powerful military warships of the Italian Navy, do you agree with this list? Let us know in the comment below. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see much more rankings like this.